Hey everybody, how's it going? It's The Daily Shooter. And some of you might remember that I did a review slash first look at this uh, Condor Sentry plate carrier uh, probably about three weeks ago or so, but I was still waiting on my AR-500 armor. I ordered the armor on February the 2nd, and it finally showed up on my doorstep yesterday, March the 16th. So yeah, it took about six weeks, but you know what? I'm really happy to uh, have it. The box showed up at my door. It says 15 pounds on it. So let's go ahead and take a look at the plates that showed up. Okay, so this is how the box arrived at my doorstep, and obviously I've already opened it up just to verify that the contents in there were correct. You got your packing slip here, so you open it up, there's a little bit of packing paper on top, which I went ahead and already removed. Inside you'll find your brochure. This is just a three-fold leaflet, just kind of giving you a heads up on what type of uh, products that they're offering at the moment. So we got that, and then obviously you have your order confirmation papers. And then I can show you guys how much uh, I paid for it here without giving away uh, my address or anything. But as you can see right there, hopefully, I paid uh, $162 for uh, both plates. Now what I got here was, this is my front plate. Uh, this is the Advanced Shooter's Cut, and it is a curved plate. Uh, so I paid a little bit extra for that. I believe this one was $85. And then the flat plates are $65. So uh, here's the front plate. Let's go ahead and remove this so I can show you guys. And uh, it's it's really nice. I mean, I, there's really not much I can say about it. You guys have seen probably a hundred different types of reviews on this, but uh, it's real nice. It's a heavy material. I did not get the extra buildup, you know, for spalling protection. It just has their standard spalling protection on there. So here's the shooter, uh, the advanced shooter's cut. This particular one is right-handed. Okay, so we can see that. Let's take that out. Now for the back plate, I just got flat, and that was really just to save money here. Now you can use this front or back. This also has an advanced shooter's cut, so right-handed shooter's cut on this side. But as you can see, it's just a standard flat plate, so I'll be using that for my back. So what I'm gonna do now is throw this in the uh, uh, plate carrier and uh, see how that thing feels. Okay, so here we have our Condor Sentry plate carrier. What we're going to do is first put in the, uh, the back panel on this one. We're just gonna open this one up. And as you can see, they labeled it strike face. So we'll put the strike face towards the back here. Now, I believe this is actually the largest size that will fit in here, which is 10 by 12. And uh, yeah, it does, it feels pretty snug. I think that is the biggest size you're probably going to uh, be able to fit in the Condor Sentry, 10 by 12, which uh, fits me pretty good. Like I said, I'm about uh, uh, 290 and uh, just a hair under six feet tall. So. You can get an idea of my body size right there, and this seems to work just fine. All right, now we're going to add the front plate. Same way. We're going to throw our strike face towards the front. That fits in there pretty good. Our Velcro covering up here. Make sure that's nice, tight, even. All right, so now we have plates in there. Let's go ahead and try it on. Okay, so here's the Condor Sentry plate carrier actually on and with plates in it. So now I feel like I can give you guys a little bit more perspective on how it feels, the comfort level, and just kind of my overall opinion of it so far. Now I am gonna go out later. I'm gonna keep this on for the majority of the day, probably five or six more hours. I've got some work to do on the car and motorcycles, and I'm just gonna keep this thing on the entire time so that I can update this later and kind of let you guys know the overall comfort level when I'm moving and doing different tasks. So that's gonna be my update. But first of all, I wanna let you guys know that I'm coming to you from a perspective of somebody who is completely new to plate carriers and body armor. You know, being somebody who's never served in the military, every time I kind of stay, take a step up in my gear, it's kind of a new experience. So uh, I'm, I can kind of give you that fresh perspective as somebody who has never worn this stuff before, what it feels like. Now I can tell you right now that it needs some adjustments right off the bat because I bought the plate carrier first and then I bought the plates, I made some adjustments and then you put these heavy plates in there and you know I feel the back kind of sagging down so I'm going to have to make some adjustments here and on the sides but I can tell you that it feels good, it's heavy but at the same time you have this uh, nice cushioning on the back here so it does support the weight of the plates uh, pretty well 
The cushioning on the shoulder straps feels pretty good. I mean, it's it's nice. I don't feel any spots where I feel like I'm getting any type of snags from any type of Velcro or anything like that. Uh, the curvature of the front plate here from AR500 feels really nice. I actually like the way that it's curved. I, I can tell that from the back plate, which I actually ordered flat on purpose, uh, being that I could sit down and I, I felt like maybe the flat would be a little bit better than the curved for your back, especially with the, the, the bones that you have here in your shoulders and whatnot, you know, your blades here. Um, and I think I'm glad that I made that decision. I think I like the flat on the back and then the curved in the front. It just feels really good. Now, as you can see on the back here, uh, it has kind of sagged down a bit and that, that is from the, the weight of the plates being in there. So I will have to make those adjustments. Here's my collarbones. Everything that I've seen so far, people that I've talked to have, have kind of told me the right way to wear this. Here's my collarbones right here. They kind of just meet just below the top of the plate carrier right here. So my plate starts at my at the bottom of my collarbone. Uh, here is my sternum. Right about here would be the, the end of my sternum. And then it, it kind of continues down a little bit more. So I have you know the majority of my lungs and vital organs covered where this is going to sit in the front. But I'll, like I said, I'll have to make some adjustments. Now, it, like I said, it does feel pretty good. It is a little bit weighty, but you know, it feels nice. And I'm going to wear it for a majority of the day and then update you guys. So I'm very happy to say that I finally got my AR500. This is level three body armor. Uh, the Condor Sentry plate carrier, which seems to be nice so far. And uh, the update video hopefully will be coming in the next uh, week or so. But I do want to wear this for a little bit, kind of nonstop, so that I can give you guys an honest opinion on how it feels over that uh, that period. So thank you guys very much for watching. Please like, subscribe. You guys have a great day.